Today, I have two things. This in front of you, I've never had one of these before. This is gorgeous. It's a Cotard. And it's in this gorgeous, gorgeous, I say gorgeous a lot. I need to come up with a new adjective, but look how pretty. Look at the, the branding on this with the craft, you know, the scissors and the pencils and the button. Is that a needle? A needle? What is that? Mm. It's like a vacuum. There's a ruler and a pencil. What the heck is that? I don't know what that little <laughs> gadget is, but beautiful flowers on this thing. Anyway, I wanted to try this company out, Cotart. It's on Amazon, never tried it before. And I also got a new coloring book, Grayscale Coloring Book, A World of Fairies for Adults. So we're gonna flip through this real quick at the end, not a long flip through, something I will probably try out on my Craft With Me Wednesdays, or maybe I'll just try it on my own and put the results up on Instagram. But let's break into this bad boy. Here's the picture of the thumbnail. I'm not sure it's supposed to be open like this, but it was. I think it was supposed to be lined up. It's uh, 16 by 20 inches, and it's a flower. I liked the, uh, the colorfulness of this, so I wanted to see it. I'm trying to try some different companies. So we got the toolkit here. Um, I've not seen your toolkit. I've not seen this company. So let's check out the toolkit. How is this different or the same? Well, first of all, we've got the, you know, the cheapo. Let's just take it all out. Because we're going to take it all out anyway. Okay. A cheap bag. Four pens. Now, this is different. Okay. One. <laughs> four pens. Okay. Three placer. Six placer, I'm guessing. Um, no placer, so single placer, and maybe like a 10 placer? I'll have to try, I have to give this one a try on the rounds, you know? Um, cheapo, yeah, cheapo tweezers, three pieces of wax with the green boat. Oh, I'm sorry. Two bolts, you get two bolts. Oh, okay, there's an upgrade. And some bags, which I probably will never see the light of day. <laughs> okay, I digress. Oh, nice set of diamonds. Oh, and look at this. They actually give you like a little, um, you know, you make stickers with it. Okay, that's nice when I'm just fell off. All right, but we'll put it back. Because I got enough crap on my ta craft table, don't I? Don't judge me. <laughs> okay. What else is in here? What else is in here? Okay, I think. I'm just trying to see if there's like a picture or schematic. I think there is. Hold on. I'm trying to get it out. Okay. Oh, this is nice. It's a little like a postcard here and it says dear valued customer thanks for your purchase the item has been sent with care and hope you are satisfied with our products and service we are always pursuing to give you a perfect shopping experience and we are looking forward to re your review which is a huge motivation for us to do better we are a responsible and honest seller and uh, so if you are unhappy to have any concerns, please do not hesitate to contact us via Kotar, blah, 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 for solution. Um, yeah, it's, it's a long rambling <laughs> note, <laughs> basically that, you know, they will handle any issues that come up. Sorry about the camera there. Ugh, weird angles today. So let's look at the drills. Just, this is a round painting. But, ooh, very colorful. Making everybody dizzy today. Let's look at the canvas. Clearly, another China company, because, you know, obviously broken English on the, on the little card, but good effort. I'll send them my review. 
So there is um, something here. I'm just kind of rolling it so it'll relax. All right, here is the canvas. It's gorgeous. It's so, this is gonna be so fun. Look at the color blocking. And here's what I like about it. Create. I am in so into crafts right now. So I do, I wanna do this, put it up in my studio, show it off on my uh, Crafting Wednesdays. Um, I think it'll be cool. A little confetti like inside the sun, the sunflower area. But other than that, I believe it's color blocking. So here is actually, you could put this through your sticker maker if you like. There are 26 colors and they are very, very vibrant colors. Oh, this is interesting. They do not use, okay, no, they use uh, numbers. It's a, okay, wait a minute. No, I don't understand. The symbol, they're saying the symbol is the color, but there are, this does not match up to this. Okay, that's, an, all right, this is not what I thought it was. Okay, it, it's saying that this is the symbol, but this is just the color. If you go down to the canvas, it's got a schematic on either side, and if you look at the schematic, um, it does have the symbols there inside those color blocks. So it looks like they just forgot to put the symbols inside the blocks of color, which is really weird. Um, it does tell you, like, the DMC and how many, the quantity that you should receive. Now, if you want to count those diamonds, you know, you be my guest, but I won't be doing that. And then it has a page of instructions for people that are new to diamond painting. This is like a very good company. I would, a starter company, I would say. It is not a poured glue, but I doubt it's a double-sided adhesive either. Um, there is an in-between product, but um, it's covered in plastic and it's reasonably priced. You can get this for less than 20 bucks. So it's, you know, a good amount of sticky there. It's nothing past the edges, which is nice. It could be a port glue. I don't know. It may be. Maybe I'm not giving them enough credit because this absolutely, after I rolled it backwards, it laid nice and flat. Um, you can see the symbols really nice. Let me just show you the canvas up close. I like to take the plastic down when I do that. So you're not getting the glare. But yeah, the symbols are pretty clear. It's all color blocking. Nice, huh? Okay, let's take a look at the drills. There will be crinkling for a short period of time. If perhaps it's not your thing, mute your phone. And can you see that my fingers stop waggling? All right, so, and they're, they're packaged quite nicely, all in one strip. Okay. Wow, let's take a look at the colors. I like this. So we've got this beautiful turquoise here. Purple. Oh, this is like a burnt orange. Let me look at the quality of these diamonds if we can. Get a close up. Come on, camera. Focus. Doesn't want to focus. Hmm. Okay. Well, I am looking at them and I don't see any sort of dimpling um, or things we should be concerned about. So I will give you a full review once I've finished with the canvas. This is probably going to have to wait till the new year um, when I'm done with the holidays. Really pretty colors. 
I know there's got to be pink in here. Oh, there's pink. There's pink. Is Tillman Rebecca? Okay, I think this is the 310. This is the extent of the 310, and there's like a little um, bordering stuff going on here, like you might see in a Mandy Manzano. There's, there's some accenting with the 310. I'm good with that. Oh, Christy Collar coming up right there. So this might be paying where if you've got some sparklers, you want to throw in some sparklers. That is, oh, more 310. I, I misspoke, right? We have two bags of 310. Okay. Dark green. Oh, I like that color. There you can kind of see the diamonds up close there. See? Not too bad, huh? Oh, I love this. Is that 550? Oh, it is. Nope, 797. I still like 797. Hmm. Oh, hot pink alert. Nice, 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 nice. Yeah, I might have to check out, before I start this, I might have to check out what kind of color sparklers I can get to throw in here. Oh, isn't that pretty? These pinks are gorgeous. And this... This pink's got a lot of hitchhikers from one of these other two pinks, but we'll forgive it. Lovely. Oh, so pretty. Look at those three together. Gorgeous. That, this is a, uh, is it 666? It is 606. It's like an orangey red. So, no one of these, but I didn't think there would be any with this um, kind of painting, but I think this is going to be fun. This will be a fun one. Uh, probably in the new year, maybe for my lives, we'll work on this one because this is a fun one. So guys, oh, I did promise you, I promised you the fairy walkthrough. Let's take a look. This will be quick. Okay, here we go. We've got, let me get this out, get the trash out of the way. Okay, here is, okay, a grayscale coloring book, A World of Fairies. This came from Amazon. 25 Images to Color by Molly Harrison. And I'm sure that I, because I'm a complete copycat, I will admit it right up front. I'm sure I saw somebody have it, and I said, oh, I want to try that. Look how pretty. Let me put this up closer so you can see. What's she doing? Oh, she's got a candle in her hand. I thought she was drinking a Coke. <laughs> you see where my head's at, but oh, I want to try this grayscale stuff. So pretty, oh my goodness. I'm gonna have to see what people are doing. I don't think I'll have an issue with like coloring the actual fairy, but some of this background, I'm curious how people are coloring the background because clearly you wanna get some blending, you know, some blues and black up here and then some, you want, part of it to light up, I'm sure. So I'm gonna have to do a little research. See how we get that done. Oh, so pretty, all the wings. You know I'm gonna break out the pink, right? Oh yeah. Oh my goodness, look at this lady. So here, so far, what? here's what I like about it. Obviously, I like the artwork, or I wouldn't have bought it. But look at this, It's you can, um, it, the pages are one-sided. So you could actually, um, you could, I would probably still, if I'm gonna use a marker, but I think I'm gonna use, um, at least out here, the watercolor pencils, I think would work really well. Um, and then maybe the regular pencils in here, or maybe the watercolor pencils all over. If, I, if I'm gonna do the watercolor, I am gonna put a sheet of uh, plain paper in between, but I do like that. And then the feel of the paper, it's really smooth, and I and I kind of like to have that texture in my um, coloring pages. So I'll give you just. Oh my gosh! Look at this! It's a dragon! Look at that dragon! How cute! Cute! Is that an egg? A dragon egg? And then there's the dragon. I'm not sure. Clearly a reference to Mother of Dragons. Oh, gorgeous! Gorgeous. Okay, I cannot spend all my time coloring. I have too much diamond painting to do. Oh, too cute. Too cute. I like this artist. Diamond Art Club. I like this artist. 
it's a little bit more mature than the Hannah Lynn that we're seeing. Um, so yeah, I like it. it, it you could uh, go talk to the Molly Harrison and get us some of this kind of thing. Really nice, really nice. I would like that. So there are 25 images here. Um, I'm going to go on her website, check her out, www.mollyharrisonart.com. I'll put it down in the uh, description box so you guys can check her out too. So thanks for coming on this journey with me today. I think I'll have this up on Friday. You'll be seeing this. I will see you Saturday in my live. So everybody have a great night and uh, take care.